a proud moment for the National Union of Mine Workers. Founded at the height of apartheid in 1982, the union has produced top leaders of the ANC in the country. From former President Kalima Motlante to the current President Cyril Ramaphosa, who was its founding general secretary. Founding President James Motlati, a Lesotho national, recalled the difficulties of organizing mine workers in apartheid South Africa. Mine workers were treated inhumanly. They were subjected to physical assaults and so forth. Mining companies use ethnicity to control workers. They manage workers in so-called compounds through the system of traditional leaders or in donors. This system created tension and it divided workers across ethnic lines. Our pan-African political background was key in mobilizing workers. We made them recognize that as an African working class, we have the power to fight against the brutal and racist white capitalist system. The late founding deputy president, Elijah Pashai, was honored posthumously. His daughter accepted the honor on his behalf. President Cyril Ramaphosa graced the occasion, but he was not included in the list of honors for now, perhaps. We had the first president of, of the NUM, who quite, quite rightly got a doctorate. We had the first vice president of the NUM, who quite correctly got a doctorate. And we have a general secretary of the NUM who didn't. <laughs> so I've told the vice chancellor that with effect from tomorrow, the chancellor is on strike <laughs> until this matter is corrected. At a gala dinner hosted by the union afterwards, the president paid tribute to his fellow union pioneers. They were both great orators. They could move multitudes of people. Whenever there were strikes, I would send them from headquarters and say, go to this mine, go to this mine. Even when workers were angry, even when workers were frustrated, they were always on the front line and did the work that needed to be done. I learned the meaning of commitment by seeing how these two outstanding leaders operated. ANC stalwart Mavusom Simang was also honored with an honorary doctorate for his contribution to the liberation struggle and to the development of the country and the African continent. Bongini Mucho, SABC News, Pretoria.